Replacing the potential meter. In this DIY repair video, we're going to replace the potential meter, which is the button with which you can control the rotation speed of your motor. For this DIY repair video, you need a common cross head screwdriver, a wrench size 12, a new potential meter, a zip tie, a small flat head, and a small zip tie cutter. We've already removed the handles for extra space to maneuver. Detach the back panel of the machine. Remove the potential meter cable as shown in the video. Now remove the front panel and once you've carefully pulled it out, continue with cutting the zip tie. Now remove the potential meter turning knob. Use the wrench size 12 to remove the nut and remove the potential meter. Now place a new one as shown in the video and reverse the above steps. Attach the knob to the new potential meter, but before you do, make sure you have it aligned properly so that when it turns all the way to the left or right, it aligns with the start and end of the indication on the panel. Reattach the red and black wire on the back panel. Secure the panels back in their place and you're done. Congratulations! You've replaced the potential meter and can control the rotation speed of your motor again. For more information, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel, click that like button, leave your comments below and visit our website at eurobor.com. Thanks for watching and see you next time!